the one. This is one of the simpler spaghetti bridge designs I have done and it took me just a few hours to build. I usually create the structural models of bridges I make here to get a better understanding of the behavior and performance. For an applied load, the two vertical members transfer the load in compression to the main node and then the four diagonal members carry it in tension back to the supports. If the loading area isn't centered, the design can be improved by adding four additional diagonal members as shown at the beginning of the video. Ta-da! <coughs> Sorry, I need some water.